welcome back to my YouTube channel. I um, hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon or evening, wherever you are in the world today. So, today I thought I would do a day in the life of a proper trucker. You know what I mean? Whatever the hell proper trucker means. So, I'm going to give you a full walkthrough of how my day goes. I thought well today would be a great day to start. Today is a quite an easy day so I thought it'd be quite quite good really so let's go. Okay first things first is what we do. So because my truck is on taco discs some of you might not have ever driven a truck with a taco well not taco with an analog might just be used to a digi um i I'm trying to find a pen where's my pen gone this is only my second truck i've ever driven that has analog taco discs so i'm gonna give you a quick show so this is all right on the camera hold on so first off at the top Oh, I can look for this thing. So first off here, your name goes here, then um, where you start, where you finish. So obviously my home, my yard. Uh, the next two are the date. So obviously the day uh, you start and obviously your day you finish, because obviously if you start at like nine o'clock at night, work through into the morning kind of thing. So the date, NO is registration number of the truck. And then we've got at the bottom, so you'd start with, so the arrow pointing forward is the mileage that you start on and the one above it is the mileage that you come back on. So when you finish the day, you put the mileage in that one and then obviously it's easy to deduct and you put your total miles in at the bottom. And then once you've got this filled out, you pop it in the disc. So let's fill it out. <laughs> So this is where my disc goes, uh, I'll take that out from last time and then we put the disc, make sure you put it under that little thing because uh, if you've seen one of my TikTok videos uh, you will some why. So make sure that goes under there. So what this will do is as it's going round this little thing is called a scribe and it'll do loads of little lines and I'll show you what it'll look like. Uh, in a minute so that goes in there slide that in and then she starts recording as you can see here I've got an old disc see if this is going to focus in so here all these little lines is obviously this means driving and it knows when you stop driving stop blah de, blah de, blah and then obviously if we can use it'll focus in it's obviously got all the times around it and yeah that is a taco disc so the next thing we do is we fill out a driver's defect book this should be done preferably at the start of your shift and do it every single day really so first off it asks for date uh, then we've got my name Reg number, uh, trailer, I haven't put that up yet, uh, how many miles it's done, one, three, uh, time and place, I don't worry what time is it, I'll we'll show you in a minute. So, you have got basic things it asks you is have you got Ad Blue, which this truck does not, uh, the cab interior to make sure everything's fine, seat belts work, um, there's no chips, cracks, anything in your mirrors, side mirror, windows, uh, the taco works, and we've got spare printer roll. 
uh, there's no air leaks, air pressure is all working, uh, is there any warning lights on the dashboard, do your wipers work, uh, have you got enough uh, washer fluid, this is all things like you do on your daily walk around check and I will give you a little tour on how we do that really. So a couple of things you can check before is obvious one, make sure the horn works. <laughs> I think that works. Then you want to oh, get this out of there. Horn works fine. Uh, what I normally do is obviously check in here, make sure all the windows are fine, which they are. I'll show you on daily on a walk around. So I'll put all my lights on, my hazards. I'm just going to turn this off because obviously you are not going to be able to hear me as I'm walking around. So put all my hazards on, lights on, and then we'll go check. We'll have a walk around, uh, make sure everything works, you know, there's no visual things, no, uh, obviously this is why you'd keep your engine running, but just for video purposes, obviously I've already listened, there's no air leaks or anything like that, but I'm just going to give you a quick guided tour, um, what you should really be looking for on a daily walk around. So, first things you want to check for is obviously your tyres, I mean these are brand new tyres, um, so they have ample amount of tread but you want to be checking that there is no bulges or anything in your tyres, there's no obvious defects, there's no tread wear um, wire wearing through or anything like that. So make sure you give your tyres a good check. And you want to come round, make sure, I don't know if you can see these, yeah you can, you can see I'm flashing. Uh, make sure all your indicators work. Yeah, make sure all your indicators work. Yeah, so you just want to give it a quick, uh, a good walk around. Just make sure that there's nothing hanging off the truck. That shouldn't be. Obviously, check. Make sure you check back wheels too. Obviously, in between as well. Check as much as you can, really. Obviously, make sure all your spray suspension. Can never say that word. Is all working well. All attached. And then, obviously, all your indicators in the back. The lights work. Um, I've got my partner here today to help me with brakes, make sure all my brake lights work and reverse. But yeah, it's a quick guide for you. So I've just done a full, turn them indicators off, uh, a full visual walk around check off camera just to be really sure he's, you know, it's hard to actually film and do some work. So yeah, done that. So I'm all ready, ready to hit the road, road safe, everything is good. So let's go pick a trailer up, shall we?
those lights up there are working. Obviously, with it being a trailer I haven't used before, you want to check the tyres, make sure they're good, you know, give them a good kick, feel, make sure they're safe. All your spread, your mud guards are all securely attached. Again, never had this trailer before, so just wanted to give it a good, good walk round, check everything out before you set off. Yeah. Indicators are working, you want to make sure them top lights, top marker lights at the top are working. Also, another thing you want to check as well, make sure that the trailer itself has got its MOT and that you're taking a legal trailer out onto the road. So, if you look here, every trailer will have one of these. And it's just to make sure it's all above board. The mark lights are in a better place, aren't they? Yeah, these mark lights today are definitely in a better place. Now you're going to scrap the mud down. Here we go. How's the old on? Let's go. Obviously, I think it's not been basic. So I was like, okay, I was good. Just, just on my journey. So I was like, look, I need one this size. This day is A. here so I'm gonna go open my curtains and get this girl unloaded. is one load down another load to go and that'll be it for today same again tomorrow 
so guys that is a wrap for today um the only thing left to do now is to pull my card and yeah i hope you enjoyed that little insight into day of a life of a proper trucker it has been a sweaty old day in this cab <laughs> again so i hope you enjoyed this video if you do i would greatly appreciate it if you liked commented subscribed hit that bell notification to be notified of when my next video is coming out i hope you have a great day out there guys stay safe and i'll be seeing you soon